And I was telling a story about some of the little ones who are so vicious with their mouths. And I told a very interesting story. The kind of sins and nasty evil things they do. And turn around and, so, and, and insult people like Martin Amidu, like my wife, like myself. And I wonder if that's my wife they're talking about. I wonder if that's Martin Mamidou. I wonder if it's me from our own. That's when, when you say, I don't criticize Nanado for the things he does, to be quite honest, I'm at a loss as to what to believe or disbelieve. Because I know the things about my, some of our people say about my wife, Matiman Midu, and myself are false. Ladies and gentlemen, what did this small little character do? After we lost the 2016, I said he went and paid cash for two mansions. One for himself, one for his wife. And of course, the man who was selling his property that he had built for sale should have been happy, isn't it? Because he was making profit. I said he was very sad and very angry. Why do you think he was angry? Because he had sweated to build these houses to sell for profit and instead of the money coming into his account or being given a check he was being given cash what did that mean and he had to spend the whole night counting the 1.5 million dollars each times two the three million dollars do you get me when i came out of office Together with my wife, we never even had a foreign account to say we had even $10 inside it. Today, when they are tabling all the billionaires and the millions, you know, that we have, they put Rawlings at number nine, I think. Oh, second to last. And they've given me 50 million. <laughs> Meanwhile, the last man behind me is Kosi Wayo. <laughs> I don't know. Did they give him 30 million or what? They've given him either 30 or 3 million. 30. As for Kobe Wayo, I know he's so broke <laughs> that I believe he must have paid and paid the newspaper. Put me there and put 30 million against my name. I have answered that kind of thing on three occasions. I will answer it again. They play these games as a way of whitewashing themselves, the genuine and the thieves amongst them. So that if Rawlings can have 50 million, there's nothing wrong with it. If I had it, I would have worked honestly for it, but I don't. They have it, the thieves and the honest ones. But they want it to be acceptable. They want it to look normal without anybody asking, how did you come by it? They gave Felix of Osupachi 12 million dollars to come and give to the commission. To the commission. Not I don't know the commission. the commission. That's seven. Okay. We, we take some and then, you know. And subsequently, the we the, the staff and then the even the staff. Okay. And we are not. We yeah, are sure. thousand something. So even if we share that money, it, it won't be anything. But anyway, so when Felix also sends that, according to sources, so I'm quite collecting that when Felix also uh, sends that they are likely to lose, he, he took half of the money. <laughs> when they gave Charlotte half six million dollars, and he took the six million dollars, and she took everything. So, 
that actually infuriated us because you've got everything. You've sold house to you or sold land, four plots at cantonments. These people came and took it from him. Oh, yes. They take it from him. They take it from him. Now, what, what, and you watch this as a man and you. In what capacity are you buying from them? Anyway, so, as for things, he's done things for us. That's what I'm interested in, especially with the election. Oh, the election? Yes, oh, the election? Me like this, from the election time, she doesn't talk to me. And I'm, I'm very, very eager. Yeah, sure. So, that's something. I said, if I want to go to the washroom, I'll go away to the declaration. So, I was there one day, second day, I was still there. Yeah. I didn't come home. And so I said, I had, I had, uh, when I go in, the, uh, Mark Manu was there and some of these people were yeah, there. Yeah, Mark Manu, Kenny Foyata, Ati Fadiyo, I was there once. Oh, okay. So, yes, I slept there a few days ago, I slept so, there. So, when, when the thing, when she saw that the place had been deceived, as it were, she got the feeling, uh, uh, get you. Mm. Uh, we are not going to declare it now. We have to make sure every, uh, 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 this thing is uh, counted, every ballot is counted before. She started, you know. I mean, while she was talking to John in between, which is not a bad thing. I mean, John, yes, John is my friend. John is more my friend than Abu Fuad, and I would have been happier because of that. Although I don't particularly like ABC, but because of John, if they had one, I wouldn't mind at all. Okay, you understand what I mean? Yeah. And she knows, she knows that John is also my friend. Anyway, so she said, eh, "We have to count every." I said, "We don't have to." When we get to the stage where whatever is left. Plus, whatever the second person has got won't make any difference. We will declare. We can't keep it. And there's no law that is telling us to declare what I said. There's no law. There's natural law. When the place turns into the. So she saw that I wasn't, you know. So, you know, she, her alibis are that uh, uh, Muslim woman. Again. That's why she doesn't know anything. She's just walking there. Yeah. Her yeah. father. Again. Can you even imagine that somebody whose, whose father was a Northern Regional NDC. Uh, 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 chairman for a party. Party. yes. Up to now, that's the home that we have NDC meetings. Can you imagine? John hasn't been wise at all, and I'm waiting for the opportunity. That's what I don't think I want to come and see him next week. I'll tell him all these things. Don't do that. You see, me, if there's nobody I respect in this country, I respect you for you know why? For giving me that job. I have just come from Sierra Leone, I didn't know anybody. I know nobody. I mean, I knew nobody then. I met a friend of mine in traffic, so Pauline, I haven't seen that. Oh, I was in Sierra Leone. And I was there 15 years. So I've lost all the contacts here. Yeah. I said, Oh, meet me in the office, so if, if you bring your CV just in case. So I took my CV to The police called me that. Uh, the president wants to see me. So in connection with the CV, I said, Hey, me, I was taking some small job being the corner. Of me. <laughs> so I went, thank president. Before just because he said, hey, West League girls for you, you are worrying me. Every CV that comes before yeah, me. West League girls. And meanwhile, you know, he told me. He said that people applied pri for that job for more than 2,000 as at the time he was talking to me. Wow. And he showed me some of the letters. He said, my, Mera, one of the reasons why I'm not going to give them that job is not because they are not competent. At that time I was 45. He said, some of them are even more experienced than you. Why? It's because you are not known exactly. in the political circles. Mm -hmm. Most of those people are no MPP people or no NBC people. Mm -hmm. I don't want that. Because if you are a referee, you may have your party yeah, allegiance, of course. But the perception should not be there. Yeah. Sometimes they cloud your judgment. So. Of course. But then if you want the perspective, people don't perceive you to belong to any A or, group. A or B. It's fine. It helps. Yeah, the bad ones mm -hmm. naturally helps. So. That's how I got the job. But if there's somebody whose father and the boy, the man was living with his uh, father as a, a chairman of NBC, but you are quite a person. You know, she doesn't even know anything. So, wow. when you are discussing anything, she doesn't know anything. Wow. You see, she is the one the woman is using because she doesn't know anything, obviously. But you, a, a Calabar woman like you, you. Me went to West Africa seven years. You know that you can't you can't start with me. So I told her we have to go to declare. When did you declare it was on a Friday? Yeah, it was a Friday. So when I went, I the election was held on Wednesday. I said it was being declared on Friday. I said I buy the machine, and I've got the results. 
And what we have got right now, there are about, it was about six left, six or sixteen, I can't remember. We have added all the, I let the accounts people add all the rest for me, and I added to the second one. I said, nothing is going to change. MVP had won. I know the MVP had won. How do you know? I said, I know. And I know, it's not with any interest that I'm saying it. I'm saying it because that's what it is. The same way me and Asparagian also did calculation 2012 and declared NBC. This time it's empty. Then you start your street. You go to go to a bathroom. Yeah. Oh. I guess. I just took it and I said, Hey, when you're in, I found my grandchildren. Anyway, so since then we haven't been on very good terms. But it was after the election that it, you know when people people lose elections, they are bitter. They are bitter, and so 